Okay, so this is what I'm doing today. And good morning, I'm sorry. I am doing some painting. Um, taking the pieces because the skin came off in pieces. It wasn't in your traditional fashion or how I uh, get the new skin all in. Uh, you would do one side in two pieces that are 48 inches tall and the length, is, you can get them the length of your trailer generally. Um, but in this case, uh, this is the old skin. Uh, it's in good condition. And so what we're doing is uh, salvaging it. Uh, we washed it real good. Uh, washing it takes off, geez, like 90% of the old paint. And then uh, we're gonna lightly sand it. Uh, we're not taking out any dents. We're not plugging up any holes because we're gonna take care of that a little later on. And I'll show you that later. So right now basically I'm uh, lightly sanding it and then we're going to hit it with the self etching primer. There it is right there by Rust-Oleum and I really like it because I've used it on Airstreams believe it or not and I have uh, used it and wholeheartedly um, believe in it. It attaches itself to a clean aluminum or clean metal it's self etching in other words it grabs onto the surface and it sets itself up and it's not going to come off and that's what you want so these pieces down here have already been primered with the self etching and uh, a few of these are not going to be white uh, a couple of these are going to be blue and i marked on the back uh, back side what colors gonna go on the front side. That way I know and I don't forget. So anyways, just wanted to show you what I'm doing today and I'll show you the end product. Hopefully I'll get some color on them later on today. Talk to you guys later. Bye bye. Okay. So here we got the last piece I just finished spraying. Uh, these are the ones that are probably pretty dry now, especially the blue ones. I did blue first. This is the color blue that uh, the owner of the trailer wants, which is very pretty. I like it. And the color means something to her, which is nice. And uh, it looks good. Looks good. I'm going to look them over if they need uh, another little sanding and a little pass over a second coat. I will do that. If not, they're pretty much done as long as they get dried up. Now, I've already done small pieces, small white piece, uh, a uh, corner blue piece. So uh, you're going to see it as I hang them up. I'm going to try to get as many pieces as I can painted for the sides so I can get the sides up. <clears throat> the back, the top, and the front. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to paint them on the trailer so that's going to be a little more difficult as far as uh, painting so that's i'm looking at that now and thinking and how i'm going to do that it's not like i can untake this top off here and and uh lay it out on the floor and paint it that way too difficult and then on the top i have to do some sealing anyways i put the vent back on and things like that and then uh, cover up the vent with some paper uh, and tape it off so it does not get painted so but with that I just wanted to show you the colors and the first few pieces that are painted with that talk to you guys later I am not done by a long shot I've got other pieces that I've got to uh, take the staples and nails off wash and then lightly slant, sand I'm going to prepare them for tomorrow if I can paint them tonight, I mean later this evening, afternoon, I will, but I don't think so because it's as the day gets warmer, the heat, the uh, wind starts kicking up and uh, does not allow me to do really a whole lot of painting. That's just too windy. And with the wind, the paint just goes all over the place. And I am trying to uh, watch out for not only my vehicle, <laughs> but other vehicles that are in the area with overspray. So with that, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye bye.
Okay, one last look at what I got done. This is the curbside. I got one piece up. Over to the other side now. And on the street side, I actually got one, two, three, and even the fourth one done. So that's what it's going to look like all the way across. Very nice. Very, very nice. Let me get a picture from the other side. There it is. I guess it's not too bad of a paint job. Anyways. Alright guys, tomorrow more painting and uh, try to finish these pieces off and the sides uh, up. That way I can just concentrate on the front the back and the top. Thanks for watching. Talk to you guys soon. Bye.